Hello everyone and welcome back to our lovely farm in Stardew Valley. Let's check what we can learn today in a Queen of Souls or Souls Queen or whatever it is called. You learned how to cook radish salad. Perfect. I don't have any radishes. But I have plenty of work to do in front of us. As we need to water all this. Do I have a coop? I have a coop. I have a two small chicks. Yes, and now I know how to call them. Because I couldn't remember, so I called them just small chicken, I think. <laughs> or something stupid like that in the last episode. Okay, let's first water all of this and then we can get to do something else. Something more interesting, maybe. Okay, all crops were watered. Uh, let me sell most of my produce. Uh, I don't know if I should keep it. beans. Ah, we will have more soon enough. Yeah, sell the salmon berries and parsnips. I will keep some for now because I have a feeling that we'll need them later. Not sure if that's true, but yeah, anyway, I will keep some. And we should go and find the Robin's Lost Axe. If I remember that correctly from my past playthrough, but without the mods, it should be somewhere in the forest, in the south. But right now, I have no idea where it should be. Ah, cinematic. Ew, it smells. It's a sewer, it should smell. Uh, why is it locked? I wanna explore the sewers. No, you don't want to. I think Marlon has the key. Marlon? The man who hunts monsters? Why do you think he has it? I saw a big rusty old key fall out of his pocket one time. A creepy sewer door like this has just got to be a match for a big rusty old key. Well, maybe. But there's something, definitely. Oh, you're scared now. <laughs> There's something moving around in there. Well, probably rats. Or zombies. Or something in between. Zombie rats. <laughs> you got scared too. Ah, kiddos. Okay, let's go looking for that axe. And I'll be... Shorter with you again. And I should have to took my kite with me for all that grass okay never mind next time oh look what I found you found the last axe better return it to Robin and I will it wasn't that far away at all it was just next to that sewer just up north from it okie dokie hi Robin I have your axe here you go. Hey, you found my axe. What a relief. I almost chopped my toe off with the other one I was using. Thank you. Oh, you are welcome. Can you give me a discount on uh, upgrading my house? No. <laughs> 10,000 gold. Yes, we are at 360, so we are uh, uh, far away from our goal. So let's keep working on our farm. Ooh, wow, the horse radish. Come to me, my darling. Oh, another one. Better than nothing. Definitely. Oh, there is a mess. I would swear I cleared this a few times already. Oh, yes, I need a stronger pickaxe for that. Was I here before? Yes. At least I think I was here before. Okay, let me chop down some trees. Anyways, we will need that wood. I really need that copper and just get upgraded my tools. 
but I need some money for it too. It's just it doesn't just cost the you know the metal. At least I think. I should have checked with the wiki. Just in case, so I'm not walking around like an idiot. So apparently we need 2000 gold and 5 copper bars for upgrading an axe. I guess it'll be same or very similar for the other tools. So yep. I should probably earn some money from chopping down trees or something. Selling that and fishing and buying more seeds and just do that. We have seven days to go in this season. I still can plant some stuff, some seeds, like barns, even whatever. It won't get us much money, but it'll be better than just not doing anything, right? Okay, let me eat something because I'm out of energy. Blue jazz, it is. Nom nom nom. And I want that watering can by the end of the season. I'll do that. Then I'll be just uh, going fishing and going to mines. Yeah. Just sell all of this. Maple seeds. I'll keep those. And I should organize this a little bit more. I have only 4 copper ore. Yeah, I definitely need to go to mines. Hi kitty! And give me my fishing pole. I think I will go fishing. Oh, I have it with me. Okay. Go fishing because it's uh, less energy intensive than chopping down trees and I think we will earn much more money that way. So yeah, I am always changing my mind, so yeah. You get used to it. <laughs> I did after all those years. So let's fish in. Good day for fishing, ain't it? <laughs> well, small boat bus, that was our last fish for today as it is already past midnight. So I spend all the energy uh, fishing there. We catch a quite good 11 fish, I guess. Yeah, 11 and some trash, whatever. Just set it all. No. Ah, you want the green algae. I don't need newspaper glass shards. That's an artifact. I'll keep that. And okay, that's it. Tomorrow I need to go to Pierre's and buy more seeds. Whatever. Parsnip, anything. And just plant all. Ooh, level 6 fishing. Plus 1 fishing rod proficiency. And I found out that uh, increasing proficiency apparently decreases an uh, energy requirement for doing that action. And we got almost 2500. Good. We will spend that money for seeds. And that will be a lot of work today. Tell me the weather report for tomorrow. Nah. It'll be all clear, so yeah. That will be a lot of watering. Ooh, tulips. And some potatoes, cauliflower. Nice, nice, nice. No beans today. And here are some more potatoes. Okay, that's it for now. So, watering until 9. And then I need to go to Pierce. I will keep the golden tulip and maybe this silver one. Rest I will just sell. I'll keep the cauliflower as it is a really good source of energy right now. Okie dokie, watering. Here I go. Again. This will be a little bit faster without those crops, but that will change soon. As I need more money. I could be only fishing the whole day, but then if I do this, water all these crops, go and uh, buy some more, plant it, and then go fishing for the rest of the day, that's a win-win, because that 
I will have more crops to go harvest later and then steal all those fishes that I will catch that I can sell and I want to really make that house upgrade so I can use the kitchen finally because soon where the chicken mature we will have eggs and that will be the easiest way to make some food early in the game at least what I remember just have some scrambled eggs or whatever it is that's we just need eggs for it and that's it and we can have plenty of energy from that at least that's what I remember doesn't mean that it is true and while I was talking about our chicks I'd go and check on them hello little ones how are you doing where's the other one ah here you are hope you have a lovely day and now I'm going to buy more seeds we have six days to go so probably on a parsnip Maybe potatoes, I am not sure how long it takes for potatoes to grow. Maybe six days? Parsnip is four, I think. We'll see, let me check with Pierre. Hi Pierre! Okay, potatoes are six days and parsnip are four days. Tulips are six days, kale and ja jazz is seven so definitely not jazz so let me do this i'll grab 10 parsnip 10 potatoes and tulip is six 20 tulips and we still have plenty of uh, money so i will buy just more 1200 okay it'll be a lot of work but we can earn much more like this. I don't know which of the uh, crops are the most efficient, efficient, most worth for the cost. But yeah, I don't really care. We will plant 30 parsnips, 30 potatoes and 49 tulips. And that will probably take all of our energy. But that, if not all, then at least most of it. But we are down to 152, so I guess that will be all of our energy. Do I have any fertilizer? I don't see any and I have only 86 subs, so yeah, screw it, not worth it. And I'm gonna try planting it as close to the water source as possible, so I don't need to walk all over the place. And from the next season we will make our farm a little bit nicer with fences and Parts and everything as it should be not this ugly mess Ooh, I can do even here. Well, that's new. That's probably from the mod that I'm running from the Stardew Valley Expanded Oh, yeah, nice. Okay, let's start planting them Yeah, it's a bloody mess. I don't care anymore. It's already mess, so yeah, screw it. We'll make it nicer. But only from the next season. I think this is a bit too far away from our scarecrow, but we'll see. We maybe lose some produce. But yeah, it's worth it. It's fine. It happens. Okay, and 49 tulips, they will be on this side probably. I don't want to spend all the energy with only tilling the soil. We are already quite low. This is the biggest problem right now, before the sprinklers and upgrades to the watering can. We can water only one block at a time. Oh, that cauliflower is quite alright. 75 energy or something like that. Maybe even more. 75, yeah. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Love the music. Bye. 
papá. <risa> Okay, one part is done. Now the second half. Let me square it at least a little. So it's not that terrible. again so another cover flower enjoy it okay perfect now just water it and then we can spend the rest of the day fishing and don't worry guys I'll be skipping ahead so you don't need to be watching this again because it's boring I don't I think that you don't want to watch all this just watering crops and doing nothing interesting. If I'm mistaken, please let me know in the comments. I will gladly hear from you of your opinions. I need to go and fill it again. But hell. I need more water. Pop. Out of energy again. Okay, my last cowry farmer. Here you go. Maybe I should have kept some of the produce that I sell. I have some jazz here and parsnip. Oh, I have nine parsnips here for eating. And then I can always catch some fish or take back these potatoes. Yeah, I keep those 10 potatoes. Okay, so this is watered and I'm just going to get some fishes, so go fishing, but not here, maybe going to forest, because I can't catch that many or that good fish here in a river, at least what I've seen, it was only two types of fish and it wasn't great, so maybe try here in a forest, there should be a lake close by yeah here let's try it here let's go I'll see you in at night in a couple of hours okay no more fishing for today I exhausted all the energy and I don't really want to be eating uh, our fish or anything else for getting energy because we will still need a lot of it for watering our crops so that's it for today, I record a minnow, I have no idea what that fish, but it is a small river fish, never heard about it, but then I'm not an expert. We have sunfish, chub and bream, so yeah, quite alright for a couple of in-game hours of fishing, so let me sell all that, and that will be all for today, let's go to bed, and when it will be raining, I'll go to mines. Because we need that copper. Okay, how much we earned from that fish? Uh, not great, not terrible. Yeah, it could have been better, but worse. On the other hand, too. Okay, it is what it is. Anyway, season is uh, going to end soon. Ah, tomorrow is a forward dance. Okay, we will not be dancing because we don't know really anyone. Okay, we have a letter. Come by the shop and check on the new rods I'm selling. They are the best the money can buy and you can customize them with different kinds of tackle. Hope to see you soon. Maybe that's a good investment by a new fishing rod that we can use with uh, baits too. Okay, there Alistair. Tomorrow we are all getting together for the flower dance. If you can find a partner, you might even want to participate in the dance yourself. There's a little clearing beyond the forest west of town where we hold the dance. Arrive between 9am and 2pm if you're interested. Mayor Lewis. Okay, I'll be there. But I won't be dancing because I don't have a partner. Because I didn't really spoke to anyone in this village. Because I'm trying to make some living. 
from this land and upgrade my house because I'm missing my old kitchen. So I'll see you there. Now I need to water all these crops before they decide to go somewhere. Let's do this. Okay, I slept through all the watering process. I don't know how I've done it, what I've done, but I know that I ate three raw potatoes to get through it. So yeah, it wasn't great, it wasn't fun. But it is done now and we are out of the energy. So maybe what do we have here? I shall still meet a couple of people. So maybe go walking around the village and greet me and whatever with the others. Oh, I put that in the wrong uh, box. Put it here. Nice. So I will go around the town. Maybe go to a salon. Maybe you we'll meet some people there. And I see something on the ground. Ooh, a lost book. Okay, I'll take that to Gunter, or whatever is his name in a museum. Gunter? Gunter? Something like that. Oh, hello! Nice shoes! Shoes! Are those made of the plastic? No, they are made of your skin. In the future. From the future. Something like that. I have no idea what I'm talking about. Now, now, dear, it's important that Dr. Harvey takes a good look at you. He's a nice young man. Behave yourself for your dear old wife's sake. <laughs> okay, ju let's just keep through talking to them. Oh, I never met you. Can I go and visit you? Oh, I can. Have you met my mother? She's a town's carpenter. Ah, that's Maru. I even forget she was working here. Okay. Hi, Harvey. Bye, Harvey. <laughs> See you later. Hi old grumpy George. Let's love you. You're a good guy. Maybe we'll meet those uh, missing people here in Saloon. Maybe. Well, but no one is here. What's this bullshit? Where's everyone? Nah, I'll come back in later. Just check the bins. If you are hiding something from me. Ooh, I see some worms in the ground. Oh, quite good. That's always handy. Uh, I, I would like to go fishing, but we are out of the energy. Maybe I can buy some food from gas at the saloon. Something, you know, edible. Ooh, another bin. Let me check for some bread. Nothing. Bummer. What about this one? No luck. Yeah, I'm a scavenger now. I already checked that one. Nope, nothing. Not even muffin. Oh, Abigail, hi. Yeah, tomorrow is the flower dance, but I'm not in good terms with anyone. Just Joe the one heart, and that's it. At least I'm going to talk to talking to people. Oh, let me check. I can see who, are, who we are missing. Ah, yeah, that's Emily, Gus, and this is that idiot from Juja Mart. I don't like him. Okay, so that's three people. Let's meet them. Gus and Emily, maybe I will see them in the saloon. Hi, idiot. I just I was just supposed to meet you, you know the quest. That's it. Nothing else. I won't see you again, mate. Okay, and we are missing only those two people, so Gus and Emily, I guess. The girl with the blue hair, not the Abigail, the other girl with the blue hair. She has a purple hair, right? Yeah, so Emily has blue hair. Let's go swing by the saloon and let's see, hopefully there will be more people in. No one I think Emily is working here. Come on, Gus, where are you? What the hell? Where is everyone? Okay, then maybe at the evening? I can't even buy anything when... Yeah, makes sense, no one is there. Okay, I will eat that potato and go fishing. Fuck's sake. 
Hello there. Bye there. Don't really want to talk to you, just meet you. Hello. Just be a polite. Ooh. I see some wormies. Give me that book. Another lost book. Some clams. Okie dokie. Eat potato. And go and catch some fish. For a few hours and then we will go to a saloon to meet Emily and Gus. And with that, the introductions to the village should be done. Or is it town? I always mix that up. Especially now when I'm playing graveyard keeper keeper because there is a village and a town and here it is a town I guess and a city <laughs> Whatever anyways now I'm catching seaweed apparently not even a fish Let's try this time for some fish, please Hi really Don't stand right behind me you creep You have all this place and you need to be ca fishing just right next to me. You are a proper dick, mate. Now let me catch that, catch that fish. And I will move because you are a dick to me. Okay. Oh, bait. Bye. I'll be here. Bloody hell. What an idiot. Pa -bum, pa -bum, pa -bum, pa -bum, pa -bum. The last fish and we are going to saloon to get some beer. Hmm, I could use some beer right now. Maybe I will. Hey, herring, okay. Go to the saloon. Let's meet the rest of the town. Pelican town, yeah, that's it. So it's not a village, it's a town. Pelican town. Yeah, finally, there she is, Emily and Gus. The two remaining people that I need to meet. Hi, Emily. And hi, Gus. Yay, finished. Give someone a gift. No, I won't. Uh, do you want a clam? Thanks. Yeah, she wants a clam. Whatever. I finished another quest. <laughs> Good. Beer costs a four, 400. No. Oh. Salad, 113 energy. Coffee, yeah, I'm having one right now. Cheese curry for 600, not worth it. I want that. I buy two salads, yeah, for the energy. And that's it. See you later. I need to go to bed and sell the, the fish that I caught. Do, 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 do. Quite a successful day. I'm satisfied with it. We have not done much, but yeah. I really need those upgrades. Hopefully, in a couple of days, it will be raining. Because I want to go to the mines. Ah, oh, my cat is behind it. I want to go to the mine to prepare for upgrades because we need five copper bars for water income and I want to upgrade at least an axe so that will be another five copper bars and 2000 gold for each yikes okay how's tomorrow not fortune teller tomorrow a uh, beautiful sunny day again. But yeah. You some beans. Give me beans. Good green beans. Okay, let's sell them. And then I'll go water all of it. Beach, you will not be watching because it's boring and takes a lot of time. 
So, see you soon! Whew! Well done! Now we, I can check on my chicks and they're already grown up! Hello, Gumbo! You are a big chicken there! Where is the other one? He, you have a plenty of grass to feed on! Great! Oh, we have some eggs! Yeah, we already have! Four of them even! Great! We can sell those! Oh! What's that? Hi Astra, now that you own a farm animals, I thought I'd let you in on a little secret, okay? Tell me. They won't wander out of the fenced areas on your farm, so you are afraid to leave them open. Okay, good. And that's it? <laughs> okay, I'm keeping them open so they can wander whenever they want. Let me cut let me get cut a little bit of this grass so we can have a hay. Hey, 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 we will need the hay for a winter. I can always buy some from Marnie, but yeah, that costs gold. And we don't really have that much, as you can see. Okay, that's it. How much we have? 105. Okay, good enough. And now we should attend uh, that. Moon dance or whatever it is. I always, I oh, once again, I already forget the name. But it should be somewhere here. Oh, I should go left, not right. Okay, I got confused a little bit. This looks dangerous. You certain I should go through here? Yeah, here I am. At first, I thought that I got lost. Ooh, seasonal decor. Unfortunately, I'm a bit broke, so I won't be buying anything. Yeah. Sorry, I'm saving money. I wore my best shirt for the dance. This sort of thing doesn't happen very often. Hi, Esther. Get to see you here. Get to see you too. This strawberry joe is truly remarkable. I'm here for the free cake. Yeah, of course. Who isn't? Frog season is really starting to pick up. Frog season. Hmm. Now this is the life. Huh, kid? Sweet wine, a bubbling brook, warm air. Did I mention wine? Yeah, I know you are an alcoholic. Get the fuck out of my face. Bye. I've been working on these four arrangements for a week. Do you like them? Yeah, looks kind of alright. Okay, let's start this chat. Anyway, I don't have a partner to dance with, so... I'll just be watching others. Let the show begin! I wasn't sure what I want to say. May the force be with you all. Abigail looks that she is enjoying it. <laughs> Emily doesn't look that happy at, at all, and Maru, well, she is particip participating. That's it. Ta da! That was fun. Time to go home. Yes. Time to go home. It's 10 o'clock, and I don't have an energy. Okay. Never mind then. I'm gonna sell those eggs. I won't be eating them raw. No. I know it can be done, but I won't do it. Meow. Nighty night. Level 5 farming. Level 5. Okay, we can choose a profession, either rancher or tiller. Crops worth 10% more or edible products worth 20% more. I'll go with tiller. Yeah, I like my crops. 620 gold. Okay. And 3 days to go. And I still not been in a mine. Okay. Pursuit cloudy with a light breeze, except lots of pollen. Okay, it won't be raining at all. Oh, hi Lewis. I was checking your shipping bin. Pierre and Sophia had a large number of products to ship this morning. Alistair, I'm ha very happy you are getting situated here in a Stardew Valley. And you are making great progress on Ravenclaw Farm. Yeah, thank you. 
appreciate that. I need to walk over to Fairhaven Farm and check if Andy is shipping anything. He usually has high quality forage from Cindersap Forest. It must be convenient to be able to forage in your backyard. I'll leave you to your farm work. Yes, leave me to my farm, uh, blah, blah, blah. farm work. Get lost. No, I like you. You are cool, bro. Okay, we have something to gather. Okay, and some potatoes, of course. So we will not need to water that many crops anymore. So that means we can spend more time fishing. Or go to the bloody mines, finally. Yeah. That sounds like a plan. Because I need to go, really, to get that copper. I have some bars, but definitely not enough for an upgrade. And with this harvest, I should have enough money. For at least the water can upgrade. Axe and the others can wait a little bit more, but I want that water can. Watering can, I mean. Okay, let's go. Ooh, another cinematic. <laughs> What's going on here? That looks like a bean. Beans. Alistair, hello. It's a lovely day today. I dropped by to check on my green beans and they are ready to harvest. Gaz and Pierre were here a little while ago taking care of their crops too. So that's uh, some kind of community farm? Pelican Town's community garden is pretty nifty, wouldn't you agree, Alistair? Yeah, quite alright. Yes, it's spectacular. A little bit small, but cute, I would say. <laughs> but it definitely looks better than my farm right now. I'm very thankful for this community garden. I don't have much property to grow my own food, but thanks to this little pot of land we all share, I can. Yes, that's really a good idea. Phew, that's all of them. Now I need to decide what to cook with this tonight. Here's a fresh green bean straight from the wine. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Om nom 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 nom. <laughs> Thanks, Leah. See you, <coughs> See you later. <laughs> okay. Let's back on track to the mines. Good day, Alistair. Good day to you too. Ah, <sighs> Morris promised Jojo would clear away this rock slide by now. Susan is trapped at home and can't get out except via train. Now he is telling me the cleanup operation is delayed until early summer. My hands are tied. Can we use some dynamite? <laughs> As the mayor of the Pelican Town, it's my duty to ensure everyone is safe. Morris and I will reach a resolution regarding the rock slide soon. I'm just relieved no one was hurt during the rock slide. Yeah, we, we should get rid of that moron from Georgia Mart. I must be on my way, Alistair. Don't bother using your pickaxe to try to remove these rocks. It would take you months. Okay, give me some dynamite. And I can blow it to the air. As high as the rockets. I don't know if you have a rocket in this universe, but... Yeah, as high as the rockets. Just blast off. Okay, where's the mine? I need to go mining. I don't have time for this. Oh, I should have. Should have me, should have me, what should have me? I like this mod. Very much. But the fucking mine is too far away. It takes forever to get here. Okay, let me go to 10. And let's start mining. Give me copper. Give me copper. Give me copper. Give me copper. No other. I want copper. No copper here. Oh, I need to kill one more slime to finish that initiation quest. Ah, green bastard. Die. Da -da, and it's done. Perfect. We need to swing by the. I don't remember what they are called. Adventurers Guild. Yeah. Hi, buggy. Die, buggy. Okay, no copper here on this level. Let's check the other one. At least we have for that one upgrade. That's enough. And swing by by the Adventurers Guild. Tell them that I'm magnificent. You've proven yourself. Yes, I did. 
and I didn't lost an eye to it. You ventured into the mines with utmost courage, Alistair. We could use someone with your skills. Do you want to join the Adventurers Guild? Yeah, sure I do. Sign me in. Give me that paper. Alistair, do you swear under oath to protect humanity from monsters and to do everything in your power to uphold the traditions, values and ideology of the Adventurers Guild? I don't know any of this, but yeah, by God I swear. On behalf of Sir Duvali and the Order of the Knights of the Pythagoras, I officially accept you as the 23rd Adventures Guild member. Where are the rest 22nd members? As a member of the Adventures Guild, you will be allowed to purchase rare weapons, recommission and discover. There are also bounties and quests you can access from the notice board behind me. Welcome to the Guild, Alistair. I expect great things from you. Yeah. You will see many great things, but now I need to go to bed. It's quite too late. Bye bye. See you later. Whew. Okay, it's not that late, but yeah, still. I have stuff to do. Watching TV, reading books, petting my cat, sitting on my butt, doing nothing. Yeah, that's that's a things to do too. Hello, you too. Have a nice evening. Okay, time to go to bed. Woohoo, we earned almost 6,000. What was that expensive? Kale. Kale and lots of potatoes, yeah. Good. That wasn't that bad. 26th day of spring. Two more days to the end of the season. <laughs> Weather report. Okay, no rain. Still no rain. Ooh, Demetrius. Welcome. Hi Alistair, I have some good news for you. A few days ago I made a breakthrough in my research on the local environment. I'll spare you the technical details and get to the point. You know that empty cave over there, a little ways to the west? Well, I have a way to turn it into something useful for both of us. I'd like to set up the cave to attract some local species. That way I can observe them in a more controlled environment and you can harvest whatever products they produce. I can either set up the cave to attract mushrooms or fruit bats. The bats will sometimes leave fruit for you to collect. Uh, I would rather have a mushrooms, please. Alright, I'll go set it up for you right now. It shouldn't take any time at all. Thanks for letting me to do this. You're welcome, Demetrius. Catch up later. Ooh, cauliflower. That will earn some money. And barnsnip. That will not earn any good money. <laughs> but we will have at least some payment for it. It's not that. They are bad, they are just not as worth as cauliflower. But at least they don't get, you know, 12 days to grow. Which is a third of the season here in Stardewary. So sell all of it. And that green bean. And once again, let's go watering. Yay! Here we are, my lovely chickens. No, I, I watered my chicken. Maybe it will grow bigger. I don't know. <laughs> Boku looks really happy today. They should be. They have plenty of grass and space to roam around. And I have four eggs again. Great. Lovely eggs. Maybe soon we will have that house upgrade. But I really need that watering can because it's really annoying to water all of these crops one by one. I save those eggs. Oh, that's full. Okay, take them. I put them into one box. Okay, what now? We have plenty of energy. Ah, plenty. 130. What to do with it? Going fishing? No, we will need some wood for our house upgrade. I don't know how much, but I think I don't have enough at all. And yes, I need to smell that copper. So let's do that before I forget about it again. Where's my lovely copper? Here. We have four bars. And yes, 
we have for enough copper for another two bars. Nice. So we will be able to upgrade at least our watering can. And then when it's raining, I will go to the mines and mine it properly. Because I won't be spending half of my energy on watering the crops. Ooh, that was fast. The copper bar is already done. And then, next upgrade will be an axe, definitely. Because it takes forever to take down those trees. Okay, let me check... Oh, take that copper bar. And let me check how much wood we have. We have, we have, we have 242 wood. I guess that's not enough for upgrading a house. So let me go and clean this up a little bit. We still have plenty on the ground. Yeah, these branches, take them out. I don't need to be cleaning it much because it will be mess again in the new season. At least I remember that's the case when you are going from season to season all those stones and those little plants or weeds or whatever it is and branches will appear again okay and I think that's it for today I know it is only two o'clock in the afternoon but i'm going to bed i want to end this season finally so i can upgrade my watering can so let's go sleeping and we leveled again level six farming plus one watering car uh, can proficiency hope proficiency and we have a hardwood fence yeah i can't uh, gather hardwood yet and we have a cheese press but i don't have any milk yet and we can craft a quality sprinkler. Ooh, 3000 gold. Quite good. So maybe even we have almost saved for the house. <laughs> Weather report for tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day, unfortunately for us. Okay, what I wanted to check. Uh, the, 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 the sprinkler, yeah. For the quartz sprinkler, we need iron bar, gold bar, and refined quartz. I don't have any of those. We have a mail. Greetings, Alistair. It is our pleasure to inform you that your farm will be featured in next week's up and coming column of the Stardew Valley Tribune. Congratulations. We are impressed with your quick progress. S -V -S -V -T. I don't know what's that, but probably a local newspaper. Or what not. One last harvest of green beans and watering crops, of course, I'm thinking. Tomorrow is the ne uh, next, last day of watering, so this shall go quickly. I won't be prolonging it, prolonging, prolonging it, it, whatever, I can't speak. So I'll just water these crops and go to bed. I'm like, screw it, with the spring, I want summer to come, so I'll go to bed early. Hopefully this cauliflower will be done by the end of the season. I don't want it to waste. I hope I calculated the days correctly when I was planting it. We'll see in just a couple of days. Okay, crops are watered. And I think it's time to go to bed. But first I will check my chickens. If they are doing great. Oh, I definitely should buy a few more. And I have money for it. Which we will have. 
maybe I will postpone the upgrade of the house a little bit for a couple of days. So we're going to upgrade watering can, which will be 2000 gold. And then I will buy, of course, the summer seeds. Summer seeds and then some... Oh, I need to sell the beans. Summer seeds and then some chickens, which will cost 800 each. And then I will be saving for the house upgrade, which will set us back for a couple of thousand. And the last day of the season. The summer is coming. Yeah, my crops are ready. This should yield us a few thousand, hopefully. All those tulips and potatoes. And cauliflower, of course. It's ready. Yes, it's ready. Okay, I didn't screw up. <laughs> Ooh, and inventory is full. Okay, let's go and sell it. Do I want to keep some tulips? Do I have some? Yes, I have some. Okay. I can then sell all of these. We need those mon that money. We need the gold. Bring me more gold. And give me more gold. And I can go to a blacksmith and already today upgrade my... Start upgrading my watering can. Because it should take three days, I think. And I'll keep some cover flowers for energy. Yeah, those six. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. And let's head to the blacksmith. Oh, I should take those artifacts to Gun Gunther too, when I'm already going there. That was the glass shard. And what was the other one? The book. Oh, I didn't have the book. It works differently. It's somewhere in the collections, maybe? Oh, I'm not sure right now, but I, I remember I'm digging up the lost book. Idiot, by idiot. Oh, this Jujamart will burn. I hate it. Hello, Gunther. I have some artifact for you. No reward this time. We need to donate more. Okay, I need to upgrade the tool and that will be a watering can. Thanks, I'll get started on this as soon as I can. It should be ready in a couple of days. Okay, maybe two, three days. And I can go fishing then. Nothing else to do. <laughs> what a lovely way to spend the last day of the season. With fishing. Ooh, what's going on here? Linus, my competitor with ch checking out the trash bins. Hey, that's my trash bin. He almost got caught. Grr, sounds like those raccoons are back again. Filthy varmints. <laughs> you sure that was a raccoon? Ah, you turned up at the right moment, son. Could you do an old man a favor? Could you go around and... Could you go around the corner and scare off those raccoons for me? They've been causing a real mess. Thanks, make sure... Make sure you give them a good scare so they never come back. Oh, I will. Hi, Linus. That's my bin. I'm taking out this trash from it. Not you. It was me. I'm sorry. Oh, don't be silly. I'm doing the same. Checking for bread. <laughs> I find a lot of hot, fresh food in these cans. Start to go to waste if I don't take it. Do you think there's something wrong with what I'm doing? Yes, it's disgusting. Now it's a shame for the food to go to waste. Yes, it's illegal. That's George's private property. No, but you should get a job and stop <laughs> leeching of others. It's a shame for food to go to waste. Thanks, Alistair. I knew you were an open-minded person. I feel good about what I'm doing. I'm not harming anyone. That's true. If you're not harming anyone, then do it. 
You can go on home. I promise I won't rummage in George's gun anymore. You can tell him you scared of the raccoons for good. Oh, you, you, you go home. I'm gonna check those bins for myself. Ha ha ha. Ooh, another one. Hey, Linus, stop right there. Wait. I know what you were doing, Linus. <laughs> yes, you do. If you need food, just ask. I don't want anyone in Pelican Town to go hungry. That's nice of him. I will do the same. Here, I've got a basket of zucchini fritters for you. Just make sure you dip them in my spicy marinara. Go on, take it. Cheers, mate. Much appreciated. Okay, let's head home. I spent all day fishing. It was a long, cold day. Oh, bin. <laughs> Check those. If there is nothing more in it, or maybe Linus took everything. Ah, empty. Okay, and this is the last day of the spring. I'm gonna sell all the fish that we found. We even found some gold ore or geodes in water. Okay, so I'm gonna sell that and head straight to the bed. This should earn us a little bit of money that we need. Okay, stash everything else. And let's go to bed. Hi kitty! Tomorrow summer, you don't love that? Ooh, six and a half thousand, even more. Almost ten thousand me mate. Oh, we will be upgrading the house, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it's summer! Dear resident, in our time in Stardew Valley, Jaja has made an effort to become an, a contributing member of the community, but we can't do it without your help. If you choose to shop at Jaja competitor, competitors, such as Pierre's General Store, you won't have the same assurance of quality and consistency, and without your business. We won't be able to afford to contribute as much as we'd like to the local charities. Shop at Jaja Mart and help keep your community great. Jaja Mart want your business. And do you know what I want? Do your fucking shop to burn out. I hate you guys. Go screw yourself. Never ever write me a letter again. You bastards. You are a pest. Hi, my whole lovely chickens. Okay, I'll cut it off. No, I will help end this episode here. It was already a long day for me in game and in real life. So, next thing, we will be buying the crops for the summer when I will have my watering can. And we will definitely be upgrading our house because we have a money for that. So, I'll do that right in the next episode. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please push that like button, leave me some comments down below. And don't forget to subscribe to see more from me. And I will see you in the next one. Have a nice day. Bye.